Hey guys, this is a review. Um, Ready Player Nine. Sorry about that. Review for um another horror movie. This is the one that stuck with a lot of like um, just seeing a few Gamilio del Toro. I believe um, it's Gamilio del Toro, Peter Jackson. I believe uh, even um, Rob. Uh, Rob Zombie, and this is the film Jaws, this was the film that gave Steven Spielberg that success, which he really needed, um, this was in those days noted, known as a horror film of 1975, um, well it's about, it's in this New England town, this nice beautiful New England town named, um, called Amity Island. Uh, this um, man, Roy Scheider's character, which is just—he's just you know, just a well, well, nice played character. He's just an all-American dad. You know, he has his two sh sons, Michael and Sean, and his wife. I forgot her name. And, uh, um, I also, and, um, then we have Richard Dreyfuss' character, and we also have Robert Shaw's character, um, fighting the shark named Bruce. <laughs> um, after, in the beginning, if you see, this is all, you know, I in the beginning, um, a, sh a killer shark had killed uh, a young woman, I guess a teenage girl, um, and then later on it ends up killing a man that ends up killing a little boy. It all just comes, and it's just, and that, and then it focus, more focuses on the Brody character, um, his, his asshole of a mayor I can't stand. I was just the shark. The shark would just kill him in the movie. Spoils, you know, spoilers. My old channel's all spoilers. Um, <laughs> uh, nothing new with that. But it's just this movie I did like, but it pissed me off with that mayor. Oh, it did. <laughs> um. So the three all go on this boat to kill the shark. Um, I did like that, uh, and this was, you could tell the shark was so fucking fake. Um, when Robert Shaw's character slid through the, um, to Bruce's mouth, shark, Bruce the shark's mouth, um, when it g went through... It looked like it went through the, uh, say, like, right here. Um, the teeth, nowadays when it's, like, something like, uh, any other, like, the Deep Blue Sea, for instance, like, or shark movies like that, it would, you'd look like it would come through a man or a woman's stomach. This was so fake looking. It just went, like, it was, like, a... It was like you were at an amusement park. That's why I love watching that movie too, because it's like you're at the um, Universal Studios. It's just, it was just really cool the way I liked it. Um, I did like that uh, the part when um the jaw the shark dies. I am gonna do two more reviews. I don't want to do Jaws of Revenge. I don't even think I don't say that freaking uh. I pretend that does that does not exist. In my opinion, that does not exist. Um, hmm. But this was a really good movie. Um, everybody, including all of my cousins and family, says such a shitty movie. I hate that movie. It's so fake. Fuck yous. This is a good movie. Um, just every you know. Anyway, if you want to, um, my friend Jacob, Raymond Palacci always does this. If you feel like, uh, suggesting a movie for me to do, down below, 
anybody famous just, you know, watching me, you kids at home. Um, but Jaws was a good movie. Uh, and I think that was... And it took hell for those people to do. To hell. Like, they had to, like... Um, for making that film, wow. I could imagine how much hell those people went through. Uh, Steve Spielberg said that haunted him for, like, to this day. But, um, yeah, Jaws is a good movie. Um, special, special thumbs up. But, um, I promise I will do more horror reviews and get more, I'll do a rant, rant, whatever, um, get more into the movies, you know. This one was just, you know, everyone knows this. This is like a, such a cool instant classic. Next ones I'm going to do is just, you know, I believe I'm going to do later, I'm going to do two, the next two in the series. And probably between, I will probably do Scream, I don't know. Don't know what I'm going to do, but reviews, this was Jaws. Hope you liked it.